Here's what you do if one of your loved ones dies. Save this video because I'm going to break it down step by step for you so that during a period of high stress, you can think clearly. If there are no medical professionals nearby, contact emergency services to get a proper pronouncement of death. After the pronouncement has been made, contact your prepaid funeral planning company. And if there is no prepaid funeral plan, perhaps the local funeral director, so that they can make arrangements to take your loved one into care. You'll then want to notify close family members and then very possibly an employer. Once that is done, locate the will and or trust and testamentary documents. And if these are being stored professionally, the executors can arrange to have them returned. If your spouse died with no will, you will need to make an application for a grant of letters of administration. These are not letters, they're actually court documents and having a professional assist you can make your life much easier. And special tip, get at least 10 death certificates. Don't just get one, get multiple copies of the death certificate because you will need this for every single institution that you're going to have dealings with over the next six to 18 months. Thanks for watching. I hope this video will help you through what will be a difficult time.